that you got your uh, kit opened up and uh, unpacked. Um, uh, it's time to assemble it. Um, this video is just an assembly video, It'll give you instructions how to do it. Of course, you'd have your speedos mounted and soldered on your PDB board. That's it for a different video. But let's go ahead and get started uh, with assembling uh, the the BDQ 250. Um, I'll give you a breakdown of the parts real quick. Got 16 millimeter screws, uh, 8 millimeter screws, uh, 7 millimeter hollow little standoffs, um, 27 millimeter and 32 millimeter standoffs. Uh, and you got your rear and front landing gear, uh, battery strap, power distribution board, uh, main bottom chassis, camera plate. Uh, uh, this is your electronics where you put your uh, flight controller and maybe your uh, camera transmitter here. Um, your battery would go here and this is the top deck. Um, so we'll go ahead and just go ahead and do right into the assembly of this quad. Um, I like taking the, person, uh, the PDD board and when assembling it I like to kind of roll it in. I'll start with the back or the front. Kind of press it in with my thumbs like that. You'll hear it snap into place and then the uh, power distribution board is installed. Um, at this point um, move some of these little parts over out of the way here. Maybe off screen, but uh, you'll see. So uh, at this point, um, what uh, you do next is take uh, four of these uh, 16 millimeter screws and put them in these four holes um, up through the back side. Um, now these screws are all countersunk here. Like all over the quad, they're all countersunk uh, for a nice finish. Um, but it's these four right in front of and behind the uh, power distribution board there. Put these four in. That. So um, what I like to do is grab the screws with my fingers and then just turn it flat over on your workbench or your table um, so they poke up like that and don't push through of course because they're flat on the bottom. So at this point you want to take some 7 millimeter uh, hollow tubes, put them on the screws that are sticking up, four of those. Um, next uh, you would want to take your uh, your electronics board where you mount your flight controller. Um, I like taking doing the battery strap uh, on there first. It's a little bit easier. So we'll put the battery strap on through the slots provided. Go ahead and put that on and get it out of the way. Well, put it on right way the first time. So, put that on, tuck it out of the way. So uh, go ahead and line these front two and these side two onto those posts like that. So then you want to take some 27 millimeter 27 millimeter uh, posts. Kind of just put them on the screws. Just finger tighten them enough to kind of get them started. You might have to wiggle it so it starts, so the screw isn't spinning in there. Oops. That. Just a thread, just enough so the screw doesn't fall out when you turn it back over. So now you got those screws. You go ahead and turn it over. Tighten the screws on the bottom through the bottom deck there. Okay, next step um, be your uh, top deck, and uh, we'll put that in. And I'll show you a little trick with that uh, with the camera plate because we'll put that in right after. Um, so you take your uh, top deck there, take some eight millimeter screws. Get those in. Don't snug them down yet, quite yet. Uh, the back two you can snug down, uh, but the ones in the front just hold off on snugging down, down so we can slide the camera plate in. Just makes it for a little bit easier installation. So don't tighten that. Um, so now at this point I'll take the camera plate. You see on the camera plate there is a uh, two uh, on the bottom and uh, one slot on the top and that's just how it goes. One slot, two tops, so you make sure you got it the right way. 
skip it, get it in, get both screws top and the bottom. You got the camera plate in. You can go ahead and snug these two screws down now a little bit. Um, tighter, of course. And then uh, you can take your front standoffs and uh, slide those in next to your camera plate. Do the top ones first. Take another 8mm screw. Slide that in. And at this point, flip your quad over. Take some 8mm screws, get in the bottom front standoffs. Lock everything down. go. Got the camera plate. All the standoffs are in. Now there's some standoffs that go in the back here. Um, it also holds your landing gear as well. So some more 7 millimeter hollow tubes. Slide those in underneath. Line it up. Take a 14 millimeter screw. Push it through. And you want to take your landing gear and screw it on through the countersunk through the bottom hole there. The same with the uh, other side, of course. Yep. Kind of doing this upside down for the video, but finger on that other rear landing gear. And then you've got your front two landing gear posts, screws up front, countersunk holes. Right. That's it. Now you got it assembled. Any questions, please feel free to send an email over to us at voodooquads.com. Um, we try to check some comments, post, like us, follow us on Facebook. And that's it. Thanks a lot.